Babies. Ron Derringer, I'm a vet with two Purple Hearts. Conduct under fire in the U.S. military. Spec Ops. 91 to 02. Um, I was shot twice, stabbed once. Paralyzed from neck down for two years. Coma for nine months. Oh, thanks. God bless. Thanks. I uh, became homeless. Uh, had a place in Bend, Oregon. You had a little room I was renting for almost a year. Long story short, found out that the person I was paying rent to didn't own the house. I was given 20 minutes to leave, and all I was allowed to take was my truck and my clothes. I became homeless, come down here, trying to figure out exactly what I could do. Within three weeks, I went from having nothing but my clothes and my truck and being homeless to I have a room that I can rent out of Sacramento. Um, my best friend and I, we went through the only person, I was awarded the court from five hours old till I was 18, so I knew no family, no friends, no nothing, except for one person. And we went through all, we met in kindergarten, and we stuck together through thick and thin, no matter where I went, we stuck together and kept in touch, even all the way to Iraq. In Iraq, we were on patrol. The man was two feet away from me. We were, you know, doing our patrol, and he got hit in the head with a 50 caliber sniper rifle. His head literally exploded on the side of mine. All I wanted to do is give up. You know, I was give up to my anger, surrender to my pain, as it says in the poem I've written. But I got to remember, it, again, as in my poem, no matter what I did in my life, I've always been our father's child. And I always try to remember that, no matter what happens, no matter how good or how bad. You know, he sees what's happening. And no matter what my situation is, is irrelevant as long as he's happy with me. Or at least knows that I've done the best I can with what I have. Yeah. Let me know when you're ready. Go for it. This poem I wrote myself. It's my life in a poem. And uh, it says, Our Father's Child, that's the title of the poem. It says, Looking up at the rotor blades, desert as far as I can see. On my way to do my country's bidding. But no matter what I must do, I must always remember, I will always be our father's child. Will you still be proud of me? Two years later in Iraq, my best friend, which I told you about before, is on patrol. The only man I ever spent from kindergarten to Iraq with. Just down by 50 caliber sniper rifle. All I want to do is give up to this anger. All I want to do is give up to this pain. But no, I must never give up. No, I must never give up to this anger. No, I must never give up to this pain. For I will always be your father's child. Will you still be proud of me? Two years later, my firstborn child in my wheelchair, being paralyzed from neck down. Son. Son, I can't hold you. Son, I can't move with you. And son, I can't walk with you. But someday, someday I will move with you. I will walk with you, and I will move with you. Will you still be proud of me? Five years later, shot twice, stabbed once, paralyzed from neck down for two years. Best friend, shot by 50 caliber sniper rifle. And finally, my newborn son died to a car accident, aged me. Each five. But no matter what happened, I never gave up to my anger. I never surrendered to my pain. For I have always been our father's child. Are you so proud of me? In the poem, it says my son had died to a car accident. I didn't go into detail because I didn't know if children would read this and whatnot. But my wife and I. I married her, she was a Russian citizen, born and raised. I married her, the deal was, I marry her for two years, we divorce, she becomes an American citizen, and what I got out of the deal was, she produces me a child, Mikhail Matthew Derringer. So, I, when I was paralyzed from neck down for two years, she tried to take our son and take him to Russia. I fought her in court, and my family and I beat her so badly in court that so they were ordered if she's ever caught out of the city of Bangor, Maine, and me or my family isn't present when she has her child, 
she's instantly arrested for kidnapping. She waits two, maybe three months, I can't remember exactly how long it was after the court thing, but she waits, I had to leave out of specialized rehab. I just went from a stage four quadriplegic to a stage two paraplegic. And they had me leave state for specialized rehabilitation. She waits until a month after I left. And on Father's Day, to get even with me, she loaded our son into the Suburban, drove the Suburban onto the train tracks. She hit a train head first, killing our son and her on Father's Day as revenge to me. And then on the note of the place she was at in Bangor, Maine, there was a note saying, if I can't have another kid in you. And that was the reason why my son had passed away. Ron. As I said before, I'm getting off the streets in a matter of days. Um, and i not meant to be here. I'm not your typical homeless person like a lot of people think. So we, they see a homeless person, he's a drunk or he's an alcoholic. I don't drink. I despise drugs. I have three, three habits or three addictions in life. Coffee, cigarettes, and Pepsi. And Lord help you if I ain't had my coffee in the morning. Um, people tell me I'm about as country as scrambled eggs. I like to see myself as a little city fight, but apparently everybody I know disagrees, so I can't argue with that. But, you know, my objective is to get to Sacramento, San, San Fran area, finish what I started once and for all, become the person I have. I spent my entire life, for whatever reason, being this or being that, being this for my country, being this for my family, um, and never being what what is that? I needed for me never being me never doing what was important to me for me I was always my family my son my country my this my that I've got to be that person and I finally got to the point where through all I've been through through all I've done through all I've sacrificed you know if I don't start doing something for me who else will and once I get back on my feet I'm gonna live the life once and for all that is me and not what society or what this person or what that person wants me to be. Lord gave me strength for a reason. I intend to use it. That's about all I <laughs> Homeless people and they think, you know, hey look, he's a drug addict. Don't give him money. He's just going to drink it or he's just going to do drugs. And people don't believe me when I tell them. I don't drink. I despise drugs. In fact, I don't even take pain pills. If it's not Motrin ibuprofen, I don't take it. You know, I am high on life, and that's all I need. I have enough issues I don't need anymore. And uh, what they don't realize is that we're not just another homeless person. We're human beings. And some of us has been through more in our in our life than. Thank God a lot of people could even fathom me. And I would never wish, even one of my bad experiences, I would never wish on my worst enemy. It's, uh, the and, uh, you know, and like a sign I used to hold for so long before I flew a vet sign, and it says, homeless on the outside, but human being underneath. You know, we're all human beings. We all have our stories. We all have our hurts. Are, are what got us into the situation. Some of us are able to get a, to get out. Some of us are lucky enough to get out. And yes, there's a lot of us that do do drugs and a lot of us that do drink. I myself is a, am obviously an exception. That doesn't mean I don't have my other weaknesses. I have anger issues. I have other issues that I deal with on a daily basis. And I go out of my way to to find constructive ways to work around those. And I still have my difficulties. Just because I don't need drugs or, or drink doesn't make me any better than any of the other people. I have my own issues that I deal with and I work with them. But whether you're an alcoholic, whether you're a drug addict or whatever, you're still a human being. And most importantly, whether that person realizes it, acknowledges it or not, they are still God's child. All of us are God's child, whether we accept it or not. Beautiful.